people welcome back to my channel it's your girl eyes by fashion here with the first day of vlogmas i'm so excited to be back i haven't recorded in god knows how long and it's it feels good to be back so i will not be doing every single day of vlogmas because that's just unrealistic for my lifestyle and my schedule so I will be committing to three days a week of vlogmas. Sundays, Mondays, and Thursdays will be the three days that I will be uploading. I will be doing a mix of sit down content videos and vlogs, like actual vlog style videos. So today's video, as you guys saw by the title, is going to be on how to make an Amazon holiday registry list. You're probably like, what, a registry list? But if you're interested in finding out how to do so, stay tuned for the rest of this video. All right guys, so getting right into the video. Um, normally when I think of with the holidays coming up, you know, people are consistently asking you, what would you like for Christmas? What would you like for this? What do you like for that? So to eliminate all those questions, we're going to create an Amazon registry list. So I first came about this idea, um, when my friend created a registry list for her daughter and I was like, oh my God, this is so easy, so simple. So like convenient, you know, the word, the key word today is convenience, right? So with the holidays coming up and also my birthday is coming up, your girl's birthday is December 31st, New Year's Eve, and I'm going to be 30, 30 flirty and thriving, you feel me? So I was like, okay, these are the perfect times to make a registry list and I know normally you think of when I think of registry I automatically think of either a wedding or a baby shower those are the two ideas that pop into my mind I never think of a Christmas list or a birthday list so we're gonna change that mindset and we're gonna change that way of thinking right so I could be very late to this game but I didn't know that you could do this and I'm pretty sure a lot of you didn't know you could do this so I'm going to put you guys on game, right? So with Amazon, I chose Amazon because it's such a big hub for getting anything. If you need your groceries, if you need some shoes, if you need beauty products, home products, anything that you need is on Amazon. So why not create the list on Amazon, right? So the first thing that you're going to do, I'm going to walk you through this process. You're going to see it pop up either here or here on my screen um, as I talk you guys through it. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to go to your actual Amazon. You're going to go to the website. Then you're going to click on the little icon. I believe it's in the top right hand corner, the little person and it has like your name of your account you're gonna click on that little person then you're gonna scroll down and you're going to hit create gift or gift list I think it says something like create list or gift something of the sort you're gonna click on that bada boom bada bang the next thing that you're going to do is then it's going to then prompt you to and at the very top where it says your custom gift list in the right hand corner it says create you're gonna hit that create button once you hit the create it's gonna prompt you to put in your name your first and last name the name of your gift list day that you're celebrating and where the event is you don't have to put where the event is but you do have to put the state that you're gonna be receiving the items to so when you click next it will then ask you where would you like to ship your items so I'm sure you have your your addresses that you ship your items to either your home your work wherever wherever you want to ship your items to it's going to have those addresses saved from your amazon account so you could pick from there or you could create a new address then the last step is so it's only three steps so the first step was to put in all your information the name of your list things of the sort the next step was to add the address and the third step is going to ask you whether you want to make your list public shareable or private so in the sense of 
the theme of us wanting to share this list with family members and friends so they can know what to purchase for you you're gonna hit shareable so once you hit that you press create and your list is created. I'm the most exciting part to start to add your items to your list. So here, Amazon gives you a bunch of different categories where you could pick like electronics, gifts under $10, gifts under there, this, this and that. You can either choose from there or if you know a grip finger head like, oh, I want this ring camera. You will go ahead to that specific item you're gonna scroll down a little to where it says add cart, but you're gonna right below where it says to add to cart, you're going to see an option that says, you're gonna see an option that says add to list, add to registry or gifting. You're gonna click add to registry or gifting. And then it's gonna show up with the names of any lists or registries that you already have. You're gonna click on the one that you want to add it to. And just for reassurance, you're gonna go ahead and click, don't leave that screen, click the name of your list or registry again, and your item's gonna be there. And it's as simple as that. So you're probably like, Ashanti, okay, I have all these things here. Now, how am I gonna share it to someone? Let's, that's the next step. Let's, let's talk that through. So what you're going to do is, Sorry if I'm looking down, I'm also looking at my phone, so I'm making sure I'm telling you the right steps. So the next thing that you're going to do is, so when you're on your main page for your um, your registry, it's going to have it's going to have a link. It's going to have an email, um, like a mail, Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and then they have see more details. I clicked the link because this way I had sent out when I'm sending text messages or whatever the case may be. I added it the link to the text message and it was so simple that everybody just tapped it opened it the list was there and voila so you're probably some questions you probably are thinking to ask are once I put these things on the list can I remove them can I add more yes yes you can so in order to add more things to your list you'll just do the same exact thing that I showed you in the previous step which is go to the actual product scroll down to where it says add to gift or registry list and then you're able to add i do highly recommend making your list first of the key things that you want and then sending it out i don't recommend um making the list adding things removing things it, it can get very confusing to people so and it's a live link so they're able to if you remove something they're able to see it just like if someone purchased something and they're no longer able to purchase it it will show that the item was purchased now it's all up to you if you want to continuously keep checking the list to see if someone bought something or not but you don't even have to do that because you'll get an email saying like something off your Amazon Christmas list was purchased. It doesn't show you who um, purchases the item. I feel like when you get the item, you'll see who it's from. But if you wanna keep the Christmas spirit of like, oh, being surprised and that element, I wouldn't keep checking the list. I personally put it up there, send it out to who I needed to send it to and I haven't been checking since. I saw an email saying like, oh, you got like the title, the subject of the email was like, someone purchased something from your list and I was just like, oh, so exciting. But I didn't actually check to see what the item was or who it was from because I wanna be surprised. I wanna wait until the day of my, of Christmas or my birthday to see what I got and who is from. Now, you will start receiving the gifts as soon as people start um, purchasing and it will go to your home or whatever. You can easily put them under the tree, not look, or if you want, you could open it. It's all up to you. Do it at your own discretion. But at least this is an easy way to get your gift ideas, send them out to your friends and family and get it out of the way like no one has to worry about oh such and such Ashanti said she wanted this I have to go to 10 stores to find it because this store didn't have this store nope you're gonna go on my list you're gonna click add to cart you're gonna purchase it and it's gonna ship straight to my address and you don't have to worry about anything right there we go
all right you guys that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed um i can't wait to see you guys in the rest of the days for vlogmas and i'm so excited to be back i can't tell you guys how much this means to me to be back in front of this camera and actually recording again it's it's like therapy so thank you all for watching thank you for tuning in and i will see you guys in the next video also if you would like me to make a video on items in a specific price range for christmas for him for her let me know down below in the comment section i will be glad to make a list like that and help you guys through finding these perfect items for the holidays love you guys so much and i'll see you guys in the next video bye